Okay, so this is Xmas Town. There you go, there's my little flag. Um, by the way, before I get comments saying, wow, you're a really good drawer, you've got really good patterns, I didn't do that. If you give the... the walrus dude, or whatever his name is, when he comes to town, give him a bit of foreign fruit. That one, I think I gave him an apple. Um, I also got a Pelly one, which I think I gave him an orange, and I also got a Rosetti one, which I gave him a cherry one. And if you're wondering how have I got all these foreign fruits, don't worry, because... I'm sure I'm not the only one, but for some reason my um, internet connection thing won't connect to the Wii. It says it can't find it for some stupid reason. Don't know why. And there is another way to get the foreign fruits. Simply send a letter to your um, friends saying, uh, hello there friend, just those three words. Yeah, so just those three words. And um, put a shell in there as like a gift. Um, and basically the more you send out, the more chance you get. And you either get a bit of foreign fruit, well just a bit of fruit or you'll get uh, like some clothes or something but actually it was quite good because the last time I did it I only set out four and I got cherries which is this my cherry orchard thing um, I got oranges and I got um, a pear uh, I only got one pear I got two cherries but that's my pear tree and I did try and plant some around them but they all died so they did not really live so they don't have any pears on them. And um, pears, I mean peaches, sorry. I mean peaches. And I buried them around here somewhere. Um, oh, I don't know. Anyway, so this is my cherry orchard. I'm, um, and obviously here's my orange one. I'm trying to do a peach one at the moment, as you just heard me say. Uh, oh right, down here's my apple orchard. Yeah, here's my apple orchard. Oh, and I've got some coconut trees down here. Sorry about the weeds. That's what you get when you do the money cheap. You get a few. But, I mean, they're not that bad. Little ladybug. Hello, little ladybug. And, I, and here's my other apple, apple trees. Um, I, I like doing trees all over town. It just makes it all cosy and nice. It took a little while to grow them, but once you have a load of the trees. And if I sell all the foreign fruits in my town, pears aren't my foreign fruits, by the way. The other ones are. Um, if you sell them all, I think, all together, I tried it once, I got 350,000 bells, because one one of them is equal to 500 bells, and uh, my normal uh, native fruit is only 100. So if you think about that, two of them, like those two right there, will be 1,000, so <laughs> you can imagine how many trees I have. Anyway, so here's my pear for it. And here's the looking tent. Not gonna look in there because I've already looked. Anyway, um, here obviously you can see my road, and I'll just show you. These are all the patterns I used. There's my knee up there, my train track. Don't know whether you've seen that. My path, and that's just some clothes I designed because I decided to do. If you're wondering why I've got a tree stump there, it's because um, I know a rare bug goes on there. I think in the wet season. I don't know what month exactly, but I just saw it on another video on YouTube on someone else's town tour and they were saying about it so I thought hey I'll do it too but it did come once and I didn't realise and I ran past and it scared it away and I was like really mad at it it was like oh crumbs why did you do that but you know you can't always do that also with the um, uh, road thing see the designs um, if I try and change those everything in my town will change so where I put that down which is that design there if I change that then all of those will change too, which is really annoying. So I can't do that. So I advise if you're going to do this, make another character that you don't use and make all the patterns on there and make them put them down in the town, or you're going to have no free space. I mean, I still have the storage, but I've only got one spot, which is that I can actually use for any other pattern if I'm going to wear it or stuff. So that's Teddy and. I'm not sure who you are, then you, who are you, or Joey. Right, okay. So he only moved the moved um in a few days ago. So I don't remember all my names. So if we just have a look here, what have I got? I have Teddy. Teddy is that orange bear out there that you just saw. Um Hopper is this penguin. Okay, so Hopper's a penguin. If any of you have seen um Surf's Up, he's that sort of penguin. Uh 
that's a kangaroo. Oh, um, I just wanted to say I love the kangaroos. Um, do you think maybe you could put in the comment section what's your favourite type of Animal Crossing character? Mine's a kangaroo. I just think they're really sweet because when they're happy, like when they smile, the little Joey, yeah, down, you know, down there, in there, like sort of pouchy thing, smiles as well. And it's really sweet because she's got uh, that pattern, and on the little belt thing there is where the Joey's head comes out. It's really sweet. It's like, oh, sweet. Oh, where's it going now? Anyway, uh, all right, people in my town. So she's a teddy champs uh, monkey. He's a little brown monkey. Bones is a little white dog. Oh, and there's Elise. I think she's quite ugly. I mean, she's a monkey, but she's quite sweet. They used to have this, I mean, ugly. Yes, she's got fat lips and the beauty spot thing and big brown glasses. I mean, she's okay, but she's not that good. And I used to have this other monkey that was called Nana, and she was purple, but I went away on holiday. No. Yeah, I went away for a week or something with my friends, and um, but my brother was home. I don't know. And he went went on it, and he was doing try tra try and traveling and stuff. And then she moved away, and I was like, oh no, oh. <gasps> miss her. But she's not really wild. Anyway, the champs. Uh, Bones is a little white dog. Tutu is a little white polar bear. She might be a more grounded. Look. Joey's that duck I just showed you. And Lucy's this really sweet pig. She's really sweet. She's white, and she's got big eyes. Um, also, in the comment section, do you think maybe you could put your favourite character you've ever seen? Mine's this dog. She's called Cookie, you might know. She's pink, and she kind of looks a bit like Bones, but she's pink, I think. And if any of you have seen Walker, so if any of you have seen Walker, you might know he's got like a white stripe down his face. Uh, and she's kind of like that, but she has, she's pink. She still has the white stripe, but she's all pink over instead of brown. And she's got big eyes, just like um, Lucy, who I'll show you in a minute. Here's the little, um... Uh, yeah, kangaroo. I can't pronounce the name. It's white. She's got little tattoos. Look, 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 look. There's the Joey. Look at Joey. Look, look, if I do a task. Oh, no. Hang on. You can't see the Joey. I'll move over here. Oh, crumbs. Hang on. Oh, hang on. Um, uh, I'll just use the name of the furniture. I know, so if I click on her, look at the little Joey down there, look, she looks a bit angry all the time, so this Joey, but look, 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 she looks a bit sad, and so is a Joey, look, it's just so sweet, yeah, you might not be able to see her on there, but she is, and obviously a little book club doesn't come up though, but it does go, huh, something, she's sweet, anyway, I'll go to Lucy, uh, let me find two too, and you talk to her, too. So, um, anyway, like I said, uh, don't give me comments saying, oh, add me on the, um, Wi-Fi thing. Well, that's too, because, like I said, for some reason my internet a hub thing won't connect to the Wii. I don't know why. I know the password and everything, but it still doesn't seem to want to work. Well, that's too cute. There she is. There's too cute. There she is. Sweet eyes. She's quite sweet. She's really nice. She gave me a lot of my nice things I have in my thing. Anyway, so I'm going to do the cheat for you later on the how to get loads of money. Because I'm sure, well, you might not give me loads of comments, but I've done videos before on this, I've, on pre on other accounts. And then those of you will be giving me comments going, hey, how'd you get this? Well, if you look on my account, I can't remember whether it's been blocked or got copyright or something stupid on it. But my um, video on Wild World, how to get stuff on the Wild World thing. Uh, sorry, I've gone. Oh yeah, how to get the bells on Wild World. I've got a video on that, and it's basically the same because all you have to do is save up fifty thousand bells, put it in your bank, save it, go to your um, like the clock on the Wii or the DS, and change it to two thousand and nine. 99 volt on the DS and 2035 on here and then you should get 99,000 bells yeah and just to prove I'm not lying I'll just show you in my bank oh by the way this is a fountain this is 500 and 
Yeah, five hundred thousand bells. That is. Oh, and there's my design, my telly one that I got from the walrus person. Sorry if I sound a bit stuffy. I've got a bit of a cold. There's all my stuff I used to put. There's my silver watering can. I wonder if I still have my silver fishing rod. Yeah, there's my silver fishing rod. I have a gold axe too. No silver even. Um, with that fountain, you may know, 